Good morning everybody and welcome to another episode of Farming Simulator 2015 on the hard working map. Now I was going to make the phone calls and that but it's still early here so I'm going to do another two hours of the episode and then we will um, see what happens from there. So if you watched the last episode you would have um, noticed that we had edged our field, made our field bigger and now we're just clearing the stumps away. We did a lot of woodwork um, in there and now we've just got to tidy up and I want to get the scorpion out today come on stump If you don't quite get on the stumps right, it um, it doesn't um, doesn't quite do it. Now most people I've seen on uh, when they've used the stumper, they've, they've used it at the back for some reason. And since it could go on the front, I don't know why they don't use it on the front. Okay, so there's a couple left down here and we're just going to have a quick drive round and have a look and see just how it how it's going. I think these are the last two to be honest.
right okay so we're gonna have a quick look around just to make sure that we've got all the stumps and I think we have yeah I think we have there now we know up here now that we're gonna leave leave this as a um, field that the highest help can do but most of the other fields we are going to be doing them ourselves because there's not many but they are quite large um, so we're going to shove this over here we'll probably get the scorpion out a little bit later on today okay so we'll get rid of this this is now we're going to go and seed um, have, have we got rid of the debt on here no we, we, we haven't got rid of the debt okay so we now need the cedar gonna uh, and we're going to put uh, we're gonna put barley in I think that's barley I just want to see what we've got in uh, in stock before I finally decide what we've got. Uh, wheat, barley, canola. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, corn is down, so we're not going to do corn. I do want to do the, the the potatoes. Okay, so we're going to have. Uh, Let's, let's just check it again. Barley. Yeah, it is barley, so we're going to plant barley. I'm just going to put the hired helper on. And away it goes. Oh, good morning, ISO. So I take it that you are eating pizza because you said you've got pizza. And how are you this morning? I'm okay, I've got the next several days off so I can do a lot of um, live streaming. Um, other than that, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. So, a little bit of knowledge of Fortress Craft. That's why I'm playing uh, Farming Simulator, just to chill out before we go and have a look at Farming Craft. We'll just craft later on. <laughs> yeah. 
yeah it's it's still early for me I've been up since half past five this morning my time um, so yeah well I've got minecraft and I've got my own modded version of 1.8 I haven't played minecraft for a while so I might see if we can run it but minecraft takes up an awful lot of CPU Now I take it the stream is going okay because um, I can I'm watching it on OBS, but I don't know what it's doing on the channel because it's not loaded on my side. I'm hoping to get at least a um, hundred thousand from this field when we re-harvest it. But it does look like when we're when the hired help is using the seed of that, it's not quite right not quite in line if you look where it's seeding you can see on the right it's slightly over on the already seeded part on the left it's slightly over seeding it so are you, are you going to be going to bed sometime today then I say Right, let's leave that to uh, seed. Ah, oh, right, okay. Well, you can possibly fall asleep watching this go up and down the hill because a lot of people have come in and come out and I presume that they fell asleep. But we're going to go and be using this today. This is our nice tree cutting scorpion. very rare that we get to use this because you don't really need it a lot unless you're going to be doing a lot of logging 
and it can only cut down one type of tree it can't cut down those horrible trees there let's go into the cab view So now before we get started, I do want to get set up. So I want to see if I can put the log straight into the loading wagon. And the only way I'm going to be able to do that is try it basically. Let's go and get our Our trailer. Okay. do is we're going to park up our trailer somewhere here um, how far away are we from the scorpion yeah that should be okay and we are going to now go and have some fun with the scorpion <laughs> actually we'll, we'll move the combine harvester out of the way first This does have a little bit of cannoli in it, so we do need, need to uh, empty this before we do the next field, but not fast, not fast. I do want to try and get one of the greenhouses in today as well still not sure where I'm going to put them right I'm going to put this over here this is where we're going to be starting off okay so now we're going to jump into the uh, scorpion and uh, basically if you remember when we did the first episode of the scorpion all you do is basically you go up to it it would help if we actually turned it on you know when it's turned on because you've got the jaws open those are the jaws open those are the jaws closed okay Okay, so just give me a minute uh, because I think that's my girlfriend crawling. Hi, oh, sweetie. I'm good, I'm good. I'm recording live at the moment, so you are on air. Now they can't hear what you're saying, but they can hear, hear what I'm saying to you, so I've got to keep it clean. I, I can't say that we can have phone sex or anything like All right. 
not straight up. Well, you take care and you make sure you get some breaks in, okay? absolutely wonderful girlfriend who is absolutely blushing furiously because I told her we was on live recording and I did not turn the phone call off so uh, yeah so what we do go up to it smack it until we kind of need to get it sort of in the right place yeah. Press O. Is it is it O or X? Oh no, we we've got to press O until we've got it on eight. Press X and it cuts it and we move back. Always good to move back. Now I do want to uh, try and get this into the logger into the trailer really not sure if we can um, Let's let's go. Yeah, not sure we can. So I'm not sure. Oh, we might be able to. As long as we can get the. Oh, come on. So he's sort of right. Okay, let let's give it a go. Kind of missed that totally. You can see with a lot more practice, we might be able to do it straight into the uh, trailer. But I, I think we're just going to do it the other way because we know how to uh, do it the other way. picking up the logs so yeah we're just going to go around and get the rest of these trees out Cut it, bring it back. Now, what I could try and do is we could actually try try and do it. Uh, what we need to do is. We hold it there, and then we go into the trailer. Oh, 
and it, it it's it's dropped it. I didn't realise it would drop it if we got out of it. That's annoying. That is annoying because I don't I don't know if I can pick it up. Ugh, damn it. I don't know if we can pick it up now. very lucky there let's try and take whoa oh, oh. that's obviously caught on something yeah it's caught on the other tree so okay so we'll just cut it see if it'll do it yeah it's pulled it there Fairly big tree there. What I what I think I'm gonna I'm gonna try and do is keep all the logs in the uh, same place. the easiest way instead of trying to put it into the um, into the uh, into the wagon and then we can start thinking about once this is uh, cleared up here about um, 
and put some greenhouses and that in. So we want to drop this, we don't want it so far there. again, lift up, turn the cab, and X. Right, so we are going to give this another go with the trailer, um, because we've got a small little log pile there, and we know that we can do it. All we've got to do is just get the height right. Right, so let's switch to our, tr our, our trailer go off up here let's park the trailer over here now we've got to remember that when we um, do this we can't switch out of the scorpion because if we switch out the scorpion it's just not going to work. So I'm going to actually reverse this, get this facing the other way. I don't want it. Um, having to go over the top of the track, so I want it to go into there. So let's get back into the Scorpion. Oh, that's nearly done. So, yeah, we're going to zoom out. I'm going to move in with a scorp. I'm going to lower it down. I'm not too bothered if it's too low because I like to see where, where my stumps are. Uh, B. X. Always come back so it falls down otherwise you may lose it. Now we've got to reverse on this. I'll find out where our where our uh, lorry is right. I think that might be be right enough so I'm going to turn the cab around side view a little bit now this is where we've got to lift it up I still don't think it's gonna do gonna do it Nice if I could get it to do it, but okay, let's try. Let's try a cut. And we did it so well, we actually missed. We missed the trailer. You 
yeah we'll just pick them up afterwards I think that's just easier so we'll make our log pile we'll move this out of the way we're going to put him down on the first log pile so we can go there and we'll get back in the scorpion and we'll carry on cutting the trees down So, get the cab straight, get that down, B, X, Pull back, turn around, and X. Small tray that one, only two cuts. Whoops, those we need to lift it up a little bit. I'm not bothered if they're straight or whatnot in the pile as long as they are in a pile. Because I'm still getting used to this. Okay, that will do it. It's in the, it's in the region. Right. Okay, so. many trees to cut down um, today on this this map
That was a nice one. We got five out of that one. I do like scorpion, it makes uh, lumber, um, cutting the trees down so, so much simpler.
Right. Let's see. Now you're probably thinking, well, why are you cutting all the trees down for? Uh, for the simple reason is, we want this land around this field um, to be greenhouses and storage stuff and all that nice goodies. And you can't do that with all the trees there. just going to cut them down. Simple as. They're in the way, cut it. I've only just got up. This is as far as we'll cut.
And we're nearly done. Just going to cut this tree down, then we're going to go and do something a little bit different for a minute. I've got to take um, my cedar over to the new field that we've got. I might give it. Have a go at seeding it myself. Because I, I don't think we're going to get the potato seeder anytime soon. Or well, we might do. I wonder how much the potato seeder is. Let's sell one of the. I think that should be it. I'll leave the scorpion here just in case. Uh, we're gonna uh, let's see how much you are to sell. Garage. Same. Okay. Seventy-one thousand. Uh, yeah, let's sell that one. Right, okay. So we're now going to go shop, and now we're going to go to sewing machines. Select. Now we're going to get this one. This is a potato uh, cedar, okay, and we're going to. Um, we're going to buy that one because we're going to use our uh, new tractor not that one which is the, uh, I believe this one that's quite a powerful one to be honest I'm quite happy with this this tractor okay, you see the back gonna queue that and now we're gonna obviously go to the shop and we're gonna go and plant some potatoes now this is the first time I've had those I do not know what they're like I do not know whether they are worth doing or not and you know what we're gonna go straight up across the mountain I wanna go a different way to our field and up straight up this mountain here Look at that, it goes over quite nicely. Look, not sure if we've got to cultivate it first. We probably have. If we have, we'll just have to cultivate it. Here. Oops, the daisy. So this is our potato harvester, uh, cedar. Sorry. Okay, cute. And it holds 400. No, it doesn't hold 400. That's the petrol. So we need to. Whoa. I need to go back and get this seeded. Get the seed in there. You can see it's quite a nice wide seed. Seeder.
So here's our sudo. Click R. Not sure how many it will fill. Quite a lot by the look of it. There we go, just under 4,000 potato seed. Now we are going to pick up the cultivator just in case we have to cultivate the um, field. I can remember where the cultivator is. It might already be over by the field. Let's have a look on the map. No, it's not over by the field, so it's going to be over by the farm somewhere. Let's drive around, see if we can find it. Huh. Right, anywhere um, around by the farm. Did I sell it? Must off. Right, let's go to the... Uh, the uh, the garage and just double check. Yeah, it looks like we sold it. I don't want any store. Oh, okay. Shop cultivators. Oh, look at that one. That's that's four point five. That's six, and I'm just shy of that. So we're gonna get that one. Uh, we're gonna. That's over by the shop, so that's good. Uh, we just got that just in case we need to um, get um, the the, uh, the the field cultivated. Excuse me. I 
I think we might do some elite after the after this episode. I'll have a change of pace. Whoa! Swing around, swing it, girl. Right. So this is our field. This is our odd field. I just want to see if we can plant. So B B Cool. Just hire a worker. Right. The reason we hire the worker is because that lets us know if we can plant um, the seed or not. And unfortunately, we can't. So we need to go and plow it first. nice one looking Yeah, I, I meant to do that, by the way. Right, so. Here's our cultivator. Nice new big cultivator. So we're going to unfurl that, which I think is X and before we go and do this we're going to go and get our um, field uh, fertilised Because you get more for your money when you fertilise it. And again, it's going to be one of those of where do we leave the fertiliser? Right, we don't know. We don't know. Let's go back to our ploughing field. Right, so. I can see the trees in the way as normal. I'm going to cut that tree down, I think. And we press V. B. There we go. We are cultivating our field. Yay! Let's see how good a job I can do with this. Let's put it on cruise control. Right, 
nine miles an hour. Get off a little bit there. Not 100% perfect, but good enough, I think. Whoa, a bit wonky there. That's an easier way. Are you still awake, I say? Cool. 
What version are you playing on Minecraft? 1.7 or 1.7 there's not a lot out yet for 1.8 looks like we've got a new guest in the room wonder if they're going to say hi Not the perfectly ploughed field, but oh, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm going to get there slowly. So hopefully to have our um, potatoes seeded today. I could have done this on course play but you know what sometimes I like to have a go at doing it myself as you can see I've done it myself I missed the two little bits off there so I might go over those a little bit later bit of grass there which we need to replow in I think I've done too bad a job. There was a way to contact the uh, mod, uh, sorry not the mod maker, the map maker and just say you know thank you for a wonderful map, um, I'll have to have a look into that. Because this map even with the amount of money that we can make and the equipment that we can get it's going to take an awful long time to um, get all of the fields because if we have a quick look at the fields you can see we're only on number one we're number seven and number seven is quite a large field so we are going to be using the big equipment on this and we're going to be wanting the big tractors so i say we've got a couple of months gameplay on this just, uh, let alone swing around this corner yeah we can I 
What field am I going to want to get next? I think I'm going to have a look at number six again. Even if we do nothing else with number six except have that for uh, forestry because it's on a slight incline that will give us uh, a forest field or we could even use it as an orchard field I actually kind of like the orchard field side of it but we've got to go and buy it, clear it and get the orchard in This is just going to clear up this little bit. Near enough, and then we're going to go and work on this bit Don't forget, we are taking donations, and I'm going to be saving up for which of three. I think we're going to be doing. Oops, oops! I turned off the what's the name. So yeah, we are going to be doing that. We are going to be having which of three in the next. Uh, I don't know, four or five weeks. messed that little bit up there I'm quite surprised at how long it takes to do these fields when I mean, you're looking about an hour per field So I think one weekend I'm going to have to say, right, we're going to do 24 hours uh, non-stop and see how many fields we can do and stuff like that. Oh, you actually got it with your graphics card. Why would you not have bothered buying it, um, I say? The only way that you're going to know anything about it is to go and play it, surely. Is that like all girls just being too lazy to play a new game because they don't know what it's like or is that just because that's you?
that's that's just you you're just a lazy girl So you've got this brand new game, Witcher 3, which everybody's going crazy about, and you're just too lazy to play because you don't know what it's like. I like the honesty, I really do. <laughs> least we got someone who's actually honest about about how they are that is just so refreshing because normally the, 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 they, they give excuses like no my PC can't handle it and stuff like that and <laughs> so wonderful well before I get Witcher 3 I've got to check to make sure the specifications uh, that I can actually play it because my, my computer is getting a bit old now I do need to get a new one um, I just hope that uh, with my workload that I can afford to get uh, buying a new one is not going to be a problem it's having the time when it comes to Christmas that we are not going to have a lot of time to do Twitch TV and I, I don't want to get it and then I'm going to have to wait until the new year to play it that is going to really <laughs> bug me right I'm just going to go around this oh, it looks like I might have to replow this field because we've got quite a few bits of grass spots here <coughs> but I definitely am enjoying um, doing the farming craft today <coughs> <coughs> Oh, I need to get a drink of water. Thing. I'll do that once I get all the uh, ploughing done. Let's go and quickly go and do this little bit here while we we'll turn around. Yeah, there we go. Looks like a, the letter P. I think we'll have a go at sowing our seed as well because it's our first crop and then what we can do is uh, set up course play for it later on now I have no idea how long potatoes take to grow um, hopefully it's going to take a little bit longer than uh, the uh, wheat and stuff like that I'm just going to cut off round here 
I'll come and do that little bit in a, in a minute just so we can just keep going round and round in a circle got to try and get my webcam sorted out today try and start getting some um, video stuck stuck in here and uh, we're, we're just going to make a little bit of a bigger turn there you know perfect fields would be round in a game they would be round or an oblong with no corners on I think that might be called a cylinder I'm not too sure because cylinder I think is 3D well for me round fills would be good because then I haven't got to worry about edges By now, if Corsplay was doing this, it, it would have done it. It would have finished by now. Well, that made all the mistakes that I got. Whoever's just come into the room, welcome. Do say hi, don't be shy. Ah, good saying that, isn't it? Do say hi, don't be shy. Right, we're going to go and do this little bit at the top here because oh, I just didn't get the turn right on there. I'm actually looking forward to our first potato crop on uh, on this map. Because it also means we've got to do a different type of um, unloading, unloading because it's not in the silo. It's not in the uh, silo. Plays that we've got no frame rate loss. God, this takes so long to plough. Course play, I forgive you. I think for the potato seeding, 
we are going to uh, use course play and we're not going to use uh, manual drive Oops, I missed that bit badly. Look at that, we did it again. Okay. Well, we're coming to the last bit of this field. I am definitely, definitely going to let course play to um, do the seeding for us on this because I don't mind ploughing it and harvesting it and stuff like that because that's the end of the crop but seed is kind of expensive so we're gonna let course play do it let's turn around here at this little bit there we go that should be about it I'm not going to worry too much about the little bits and pieces that we've probably missed we'll stop there and there we go I know we've got like little tiny patches like this here and there like I said I'm not fussed about that Oops, a daisy. That's because we've got no front weight on. We'll fold that up out of the way. Drop that there. Right, so these are our potatoes. Now, obviously, being with course play, should have got these logs out of the way. I don't want to start the field here. Okay, so if you've never seen course play or never used course play you can only use this on the PC version you cannot use it on the um, on the on the other versions so it, it could be kinda cheating but in, in a way it's not so uh, what we're doing we're we're clicking on fertilizing and seeding and we're going to go to uh, the course generation and we're going to look for the field edge 
and it's not field 1, field 7 is it? oh sorry it's field 7 and you can see these blue blue mark this blue marker with the yellow dots all the way around that's our field edge okay so we're going to be doing um, the headland okay at least once um, hopefully we can get the headland to go first now we're going to calculate the width which is the width of the sewing thing which is six meters so we're going to make that 5.9 now the starting corner is important so you look at the map and you can see that our starting corner is I believe northwest because we're at the top of the corner so it's not northwest is it it's north north east and we are going to be going down south okay so let's take the map off and before I do anything on this I want to make sure that we've got show all on on this okay beacon lights on the street I like beacon lights on all the time and then we'll go back to the course and we're going to go and we're going to say generate course and you can see that this is the course that it's generated okay so that's actually not too bad and we're then going to say right okay we're not going to want to start there uh, where are we going to be going going to go not nearest waypoint we're going to go first waypoint on this and then I'm just going to put him in sort of over here out the way because I actually want him to hit that and we're going to say drive course now hopefully it will go to the outside like so we'll close we'll, we'll get rid of um, let's see where is it get rid of that and here's our first potato crop okay now with course play it will not do the seed okay you you have to go and program that seed in yourself so we'll see how much of how much it does of the field and then we'll say right okay if you're gonna take a lot we'll have to go and re reseed you <coughs> but there is a trailer I've got that can carry seed so I'm gonna to want to um, just see how it goes but I do like that that is good now this should go all the way around the edge before it starts ploughing in the middle you can see the edge is a little bit rough and of course we've got to fertilize this and everything like that now this is going to take an awful lot of seeds it's going to cost an awful lot of money I'm glad I didn't do the big field and you can see that it will miss stuff like this yeah I'm not too fussed about that, that, that that's because course play and what we can do is we can bring down the grass cedar and we can just edge that so it looks like it's it's nice and uh, nice and smooth you can see the grass that I've missed so we need to uh, get that sorted out and welcome to the next person that's come into the room do say hi don't be shy and um, 
welcome to Farming Simulator 2015 hard working map and you can see again because we didn't plow it right we've got all this mess stuff here so again I think next time we're going to be letting course play do do a lot of the stuff um, <laughs> yeah look at all that mess there the potato harvest really really does show up all the errors and the mishaps of your driving <laughs> so yeah I'm kind of quite a little bit embarrassed about that now but hey you know I won't have to be that embarrassed in around about 15 minutes because we're going to be uh, ending the episode and uh, <laughs> we're then going to be um, going on to play elite I think and then we're going to go and play elite see if, see if I can get elite uh, set up so again you can see it's doing an awful big cut on the corner there and there we go and uh, that's that's new I, I, I wasn't expecting that bit there uh, hopefully that won't do it now the reason it's going over half the course that it's already been on is simply because um, what is it um, of course play because when it does a header um, it does it mostly on the inside first okay <coughs> and like I said I, I can see this potato field here being very expensive to seed So I hope we get a good price for these uh, potatoes. I do want to have a look at our seed trailer. I, I know I've got one. And this is a mod where you can bring seed to the field and you don't have to um, do much else to it. Now what it's going to do is it's now going to go in straight lines because it's done the header and of course we've got our ridge marker going there as well Now I'm not sure what a ridge marker is for but I think it's to guide the tractor because if we look at where it is it's where the front wheel is so that might actually keep it fixed in place obviously when I'm driving that doesn't occur because I am rubbish at driving these like this so I'm actually glad someone actually did the course play
Right, I'm just going to have a quick look in the garage, see what we've got, just to make sure if we've got the uh, cedar trolley. Yes, we have. We we own two of. Um, we own one of these. This is the cedar one. Right. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be opening up course play, and we're going to. Um, this is field number seven. We're going to save this, and we're going to put it. F I E, field seven. So, spuds. Okay, so you now can see that we are out of um, seed. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be looking for our next tractor, uh, which is going to be this one. And if I've got one of those trailers, I'm not sure where it is. So what I'm going to do is... I want to have it brought back to the um, now is that, that that no that's not the one that we want that's the one we want which actually is already in the barn with us so it's already over here somewhere so we've just got to go and find it It's this one it's got spring water in it I don't I don't know how we can empty it come on you should be picking up So I'm not sure how we can empty this. I'm going to try and find a water trough and see if we can empty it. I know there's got to be one over here somewhere. Right, okay, here's one here. I wonder if we can empty it here or if it's just going to fill up here. I, I believe it's spring water and I, I honestly don't know how to empty it must be must be let let's try let's quickly try something because I I have it in the placeables here and uh, it might be it might be that okay so we'll buy that and we're going to put, we'll, we'll put it, we'll put it there and we'll see because I'm guessing because it's a drain All we can do is ride over it, it's going to be... 
yeah okay so I was right it, it's a drain so thank God for that that we got rid of that because I didn't want to buy another truck now I'm not sure if this can hold seed if it can hold seed it will be great because we can go and see if we can fill this with seed to go and fill our potato guy oh it's going to let us is it yes no no I don't think it is not going to let us do that not hitting the trigger right so we'll, we'll put this one over here out of the way um, I'm going to try the other one see if that um, if that one will work again I, I don't think it will it's got fruit in it and oh I'm just gonna see if we can put this into the into the drain as well see if it acts like a bin It's only for water so I don't know if we can do it or not no no so we can't use these to get the uh, extra seed over so and that's going to be an awful lot of seed so what I'm going to be doing uh, guys and girls is we're going to end the episode here as normal we do two hour episodes we will be back in about 10-15 minutes once we decide whether we're going to do another episode of this I am going to be ringing up the garage to see if I have to take my bike into the garage today or tomorrow and we will continue shortly so have fun stay safe see you in a minute when we are either do another episode or we um don't bye for now <laughs>